different identities as you see here trans woman masculine feminine gay transsexual we are going to focus on them and at the end i am going to ask you to um, categorize all those uh, terms uh, under these main titles put it in the nest, then Tango makes three, they become happy. I would be disappointed. It's disgusting that people think uh, every anyone who is female or male must bear the way um, around the society. What think? What the society think? Yeah. What if people tell you why your voice is like that? This is just my voice. Anything can happen. It's not a thing. I would say that it's none of, none of the business. I know that people will judge me uh, in the uh, society and uh, life is too short to uh, get sad about such things. That was a good message in the movie which is explaining that you're gay or heterosexual to your family. This is a bizarre moment and the message was uh, crystal clear, so I like the message. mention mm -hmm. um, we, yes. we call uh, LGBTQ community as uh, very rude and uh, inappropriate words to call them okay now we have yeah. our own policies towards name bullying name calling and uh, verbal bullying we just say we have people's religion and um, appearance and race and working style intelligence sexual preferences and status these are our limits in terms of getting to know about LGBTQ community 
Not only did I learn the right terms to address them, but also got a chance to empathize myself with them so that I could at least try to understand the struggles they face. So one day when I become a teacher, I want to share the same information with my students and raise awareness and also create a kind, respectful and safe environment for the students who belong to the same community in my own classroom. Uh, this project actually taught me an awareness uh, and it also taught uh, that people are never different from each other uh, and the other ones and that people have a life and have a chance uh, no matter what. Uh, I learned good stories and even a movie that uh, I will tell children, uh, my students in the future if I become a teacher. Uh, I learned uh, uh, new word meanings <coughs> and what these meanings actually uh, mean for LGBTQ individuals. Moreover, if we explain uh, such concepts and words in the future individuals uh, and, my, uh, and our students, perhaps we will have a chance to raise individuals who are concessions, uh, more concessions and have a high capacity to understand this subject. That's all my word. Hi, I am Buket and I want to say something about the project I participate in. Thanks to this project, I learned a term that I have never heard before, which has made the project more meaningful to me. And when I become an actual teacher in a few years, I will treat my students from the LGBTQ community as I do my other students, as they are totally equal and they have the same rights as individuals, and I will not put them inferior to others, because this project has taught me this way. And I will try to make sure that my other students respect the situation and I won't let them make fun of their friends as this is a totally normal situation. And I can help saying that I am so glad to take part in this project and thanks our instructor to conduct an important project like this. See you.